this is NOSA from Opportunity Hub. So as we agreed in this season, I'm going to be presenting big scholarships every two days. So you will see new video every two days. New scholarships, how to apply and all information. If you are a student and you are checking, you are looking for a scholarship, please subscribe so you will get all updates on different scholarship. Let's start. Now you are going to see the big scholarships, government scholarships, which are open here in Europe now that you can start applying. Why I say government scholarship? The reason why, if you are looking for a scholarship next year, please, first of all, focus on this big government scholarship. They are open, they take many people, and there are no many conditions than the small scholarship. Sometimes you find a scholarship for universities, just one, they want one or two students, but for government scholarship, they take like 1,500 people. So those are the big scholarship that I'm advising you to check and stick with. And I'm sure if you apply for many scholarships, you will end up getting a scholarship. So let's start with uh, DAD scholarship. DAD scholarship, it's a, a Dutch or German scholarship. It's a big scholarship. It takes many students and is now open in different programs. So DAD scholarship is one of the best scholarships here in Europe. Uh, first of all, it's open for graduate students with at least two years of experience. So if you are a fresh graduate, you are not eligible, so you have to wait like two years when you are working. And it's for masters and PhD. It's one of general scholarship. The allowance for masters is 861 euro, 1,200 for PhD student. And in addition, they, are, uh, they pay school fees, they pay uh, insurance and uh, ticket. So everything is included. You can find many information on this scholarship. Uh, I'm not going to take much time on this scholarship. I have made many videos on this scholarship. You go to check. I put the link down in the description. Different videos I have made on this scholarship. How to apply, how to fill uh, the application form. Uh, another video I made how to make the special CV for this scholarship. Please check down you check all the videos i have made on this scholarship the second scholarship is spain government scholarship it is open right now so uh, in different program the available field or programs it's the this one law business psychology biomedicine communication nursing uh, bioengineering psychology so many many programs which are eligible they are different kind of scholarship and they are all are full funded or uh, for documents let's go in short and i remind you that i also have a video on this scholarship so you can find it down you see how to apply to this scholarship yeah, uh, so if you're applying, this is, uh, those are documents, other scholarships which are under this umbrella, the Spain government scholarship, Barcelona scholarship. So all these scholarships, Granada University scholarship. So all your scholarships are different. If you want to apply, you, you go on a official website of all those scholarships, then you find out which one is better for you then you start your application application is made from each scholarship let's take example let's take example of spain government scholarship if you are quick you see this is the official website 
so it's on this website where you do your application you check all requirements and everything then you start your application check all the scholarships go one by one then you find the right scholarship for you and it's better you can apply for many scholarships scholarship number three is italian government scholarship so this is the official website for this scholarship the best thing this scholarship is almost at the end deadline is 9th june so it's time you check it out then you start your application so everything is included is for masters and phd in different programs in different programs so those are eligibility there is a list of countries which are eligible you find out um, this is academic qualification so you check if you meet all these requirements and for italian scholarship also there's age limit so to for masters you have to be under 28 and for phd is 30 years old so if you are over i'm sorry you can find other scholarships so if you want to try this scholarship this is the link go down you search everything you get then you get more information and you start your application and remember deadline is almost knocking on your door before we close this small video let's go for the big big scholarship there is a giant scholarship chevening scholarship i made a small video on this now because this is a time to prepare yourself for this scholarship or uh, in uk you have to be having uh irate so it's time for you to start thinking of to get irate then you start your application and if you are really interested i encourage you to take a move try you to get your eyelet then you try this scholarship so this is the official website red sim the scholarship will be open in july and close in november so this june if you don't have eyelet please try your best so then look number of students 1800 so the same in bad they took more than 1000 in uh, spain it's more than 800 so there are many students and you can be among the one i cross fingers for you my friends so it's for masters then and the good things also for one year mainly uh so you have make sure you have i rate uh, to be eligible there is mm, a list of criterias but first of all your country have to be eligible you check it you have a bachelor degree and you are eligible to have a master's minimum of two years of working experience so this is a different kind of eligibility take your time you still have time check everything if you are interested and you are eligible just go for irate and you will make it uh list of courses there are many courses around the uk so don't worry i'm sure everyone can get a course or any program in this scholarship for that i'm sure um this is one of the best scholarship if it comes to uh benefit they pay tuition fees for you and you know how uk is so expensive for international students you get a monthly allowance travel costs cost for visa application grant available to variety events so they pay you they are they have a grant for different academic or professional events so there are many things they do so the deadline is november as we said so try this scholarship also 
and you will get something my advice is this if you are seriously looking for scholarship please don't limit yourself try many scholarships as possible these are four scholarships if you are eligible on all the scholarship just make the application very nice application and make many many as much as you can at least have 10 scholarships you have applied